Welcome to the Abundance Attraction Show with Patricia LeBlanc, intuitive energy alchemist, manifesting expert, and award-winning author. Patricia and her expert guests share meditations, tips, strategies, and tools that you can use to succeed in attracting more abundance in your life. Now, here's your host, Patricia LeBlanc. Hello and welcome to the Abundance Attraction Show. My name is Patricia LeBlanc, your host, and I'm super excited to be doing another episode. And today I will be talking about why fear of rejection is killing your abundance and your money. Point blank. But before I start to talk about this, I just wanted to offer you a free gift for listening to the Abundance Attraction Show. And I would love to offer you a free money clearing three-part meditation series, which you can download at theabundanceattractionshow.com. I truly appreciate each one of you taking time out of your busy schedule to listen to my episodes and I hope that it inspires you to move forward in your life and business. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. So are you ready to overcome your fear of rejection? Awesome. So the fear of rejection is comparable to any other fear. It will therefore take time to work through and overcome its effect on your life. Overcoming any fear, of course, takes patience, hard work, and dedication on your part. The journey will not be easy because habitual patterns of behavior require consistent work and effort to change. But in the end, it will all be worthwhile. In the end, the rewards of this journey will help you gain your freedom back. It will help you to make your own independent way in this world without needing to rely on other people's approval. With that in mind, let's break down a quick two-step process you can use to help you overcome your fear of rejection. Because here's the thing, especially if you have a business and you're afraid of of rejection, you're afraid of hearing no's, you're not going to put yourself, your services out there. And if you don't make any offers, how are you going to make money in your business? Point blank. So let's start this two-step process to help you overcome your fear of rejection. Step one. Identify what you want. To overcome your fear of rejection, you must first identify what it is that you want and why exactly do you want those things. Because here's the thing, there has to be a legitimate reasons for wanting to overcome your fear of rejection. Without legitimate reasons, there will be very little motivation to make a change. So I want you to ask yourself this, what do I want? What do you want? Not what other people want from you or your parents say you need to want or society says, but what is it that you want for you? And why is this important to you? Why is it important for you? Why why do you really want this? And how will I benefit? So and or how will other people benefit, but how will you benefit? So you may be thinking, but I want to make money. Well, how will you benefit? If you, let's say you want to make $100,000, How? one of the ways you can benefit is A, maybe you want to donate part of that money. Two, you've helped a lot of people. So that for you may be, may be a benefit for you. And let me ask you this. What will I miss out on if I don't act right now to overcome my fear of rejection? The final question on this list creates pain point. By pain pointing your pain, the consequence of inaction. And it's really important that you answer it honestly. Because the answer to this question will hopefully help you provide you with the motivation you need to overcome your fear of rejection. And that doesn't work like me as is this. If you were to die right now, and Gary V says something similar right now. So if you were to die right now, would you have any regret because you didn't take any action? Powerful question to ask yourself. Step two. Gain proper perspective and clarity. To overcome any fear, you must first gain proper perspective and clarity about that fear. To do this, begin by identifying what it is you precisely you fear. And ask yourself, what type of rejection do I fear? 
Whose rejection do I fear and why? Very, very important. For me, it was my family. And I end up still at the end, still getting the rejection. But when I stop caring, I actually end up becoming more abundant. So now you have a general idea of what exactly you're working with. However, you still need more information about what specifically happens when you experience the fear of rejection. So with this in mind, take time to identify the unhelpful behaviors you tend to indulge in while fearing fear of rejection and ask yourself, how do I behave when I fear rejection? Maybe you avoid, maybe you do nothing. How is this unhelpful? How is this hurting me? This should now give you enough information about your fear and your next step is to identify more resourceful behaviors that could be used to help you work through this fear in optimal ways. And ask yourself, how else could I approach this situation? How else could I take about this situation? How could this be helpful? And what potential obstacles stand in my way? Are these obstacles real or imagined? Most times they're actually imagined. And how will I overcome these obstacles? So we all have fear of rejection to a certain degree, but is it holding you back from moving forward and creating more abundance for your life? Let me know what comes up for you. So once again, thank you so much for listening. Hope you've enjoyed this show. And I once again want to invite you to download your free three-part money clearing meditation bundle at theabundanceattractionshow.com. Wish you a magical day. Until next time, I am Patricia Abdullah, your host. Thank you so much for listening. Speak to you soon.